medium show. Today we're talking about our primary weapons of choice, which are this, uh, the GNG CM16. Okay, the GNG CM16 comes in a variety of options. We have the Raider, the Raider L, and the CM16 Carbine. Hi, this is the CM16 Raider. Steve, Gary and I all chose this for different reasons. This is my GNG CM16 Raider. I chose this because A, the price is quite cheap. Um, and the size, it's lightweight, it's, um, it, it's very short for CQB and um, most it's customizable. customizable. It comes with a, um, a wrist style rail and um, all I've done to mine is add a APOG style rendoscope. I, I chose the uh, CM16 Raider um, because I'd actually test fired uh, some uh, the various models uh, so I, I did like this. Um, so it is, uh, it is lightweight adjustable stops, um, can be modded. Um, all I've done really is to add uh, the ACOG scope, which is four times zoom, uh, the suppressor for looks only, because I like it. And um, I've upgraded the standard motor to uh, high torque motor, which comes, that these come as standard around about 11 rounds a second, and goes up to 17 rounds a second, We'll show you that a bit later on when we do a bit of test firing. I chose this M4. Uh, I've actually seen this out in the field uh, being used and uh, I actually liked it. It was very good. The, the accuracy is very good. I've got standard iron sight on the back here, uh, which I find absolutely perfect for picking out people. Um, the accuracy is so good on this. Um, got removable, uh, not removable, adjustable backstock. Um, that's it, it's perfect. Uh, the GNG CM16 is made of tough ABS plastic, um, making it nice and lightweight. It comes, as you already know, with an uh, adjustable crane stock and takes a, um, a nunchuck battery in the crane stock with a mini Tamiya connector. Uh, the the six, uh, CM16, like the M4 style, has a version 2 metal gearbox, uh, comes with a uh, a metal warehouse barrel and has a standard rate of fire of 600 rounds a minute. Now as you already know uh, we have different versions of the uh, CM16. Uh, they've got all the same internals inside uh, but it just looks different. The CM16 uh, Raider has a ABS plastic wrist rail, a metal uh, front sight which is non-detachable and also it has a uh, rear sight which is detachable. This is the CM16L version, uh, 11 centimetres longer than the standard version. Um, and this has had a suppressor put on it, it's even longer now, as you can see. Um, it comes as standard uh, with a ACOG sight, um, but Liam took it off and replaced it with a holographic sight, as you can see here. Um, it's also put a hand grip. Uh, you feel more comfortable when you're shooting. Okay, the GNG CM16 carbine. Um, that comes with a handguard instead of a wrist rail. Um, it also comes with um, a fixed um, foresight. It comes with a, a, a rear sight which is mounted on the carry handle, which is detachable with a 20 millimeter rail underneath. Right, the, the, the CM16 is a great weapon to get you started um, if, as, um, you know, when you're getting new into this sport. Um, Basically, they, they come as standard, firing at 330 feet per second. Um, we will be tested, test firing these um, in, a, in a while, and also at a later date, we will be actually putting them through the prime graph. Now, for some shooting. As you can see, Gary has his radar in front of him, and he'll demonstrate how it works. Okay, right. As you can see, we've got the... Uh, the crane stock, which I mentioned earlier, contains the battery. Clip these little two little things out here, and you pull this little plug out here. You put the stock all the way in, so you can get to the connector. Just tug that out a little bit. Now you take your battery <laughs> and connect it like so, and then plug one in one side, one in the other. Extend the stock a little bit, tuck that back in. Tuck it all in there. 
sorry. Put it in. Take your stock back. And now you should be ready to fire. Now, even when you're testing these in the garden, always make sure you've got your eye protection. See how straight the sight is now, I suppose, aren't we? Okay, now I'll demonstrate how it fires. Single shot. Double tap. And fully automatic. As you can see, Darren has Liam's Raider L. It's already loaded, so let's see some shooting. All right, do four single shots first. Two double taps. And full auto. This is my CM16, uh, which has been upgraded um, on, on the motor side. Um, I'll just show you quickly the hop-up location, which is on this side flat, which is down here, which is like you click it backwards or forwards to adjust the hop if the, if the pellet is going up or down. This one's already been uh, sorted. Um, first of all, I'm going to do um, some single shots into the target. And some double taps and then fully auto to show you the upgraded motor. Some double tap. to pull also. That's empty. <laughs> Don't forget to like, subscribe and leave any comments.